What problems and frustrations made you seek out grassroots functional medicine? How were these issues negatively impacting your quality of life? I originally sought out grassroots because I was told that I have several autoimmune diseases uh, by traditional Western doctors and the options for treating the issues uh, were limited and extreme. So before going down that path, I tried to educate myself and figure out if I had any options uh, that I could control in my life before having to take such strong medications. Prior to seeing us at Grassroots, what strategies or practitioners did you seek out to find a resolution? I looked into just about every kind of doctor possible. Um, rheumatologists, endocrinologists, my primary care, um, a specialist in the autoimmune diseases that I was told I had, um, really just anybody who could shed some light on the disease and the symptoms and how to treat it. Um, and then I decided that functional medicine might be an option, so I looked into that and that's how I found Grassroots. What did the process of uncovering and treating the root causes of your health challenges look like? Uh, it was very refreshing to have an opportunity to meet with Dr. Osgood initially for a long period of time. He took all of the notes, he asked me all the questions, I was able to explain everything about what I was feeling and dealing with, and then we did a very thorough workup, and that allowed me to feel like everything, all the stones were unturned, and we were looking into all of the options for treatment with him. Uh, and then I also enjoyed the fact that he was willing to work with any traditional medical professionals that I was also working with. After starting the adaptation program, what results did you see? Where are you today? Uh, I started this program a little over two years ago, and I have been able to modify my diet and remove a lot of inflammation, uh, rashes that I was getting, a lot of the um, typical digestive issues that came along with my autoimmune diseases, and uh, an overall sense of peace in being able to work with a practitioner that was able to identify healthy practices for me to incorporate in my healing. What advice would you give someone who is struggling with health challenges and considering starting an adaptation program? Uh, educate yourself. I think people need to realize that there are options out there to consider uh, that are safe and healthy and uh, appropriate for all kinds of medical issues. And if you educate yourself and are able to find somebody who will listen and work with you on solutions, uh, I think that's the best way to proceed in, in managing your health.